big match up later people big big match up welcome again to mg sports tv hopefully you guys are doing good hopefully everyone is taking care of themselves and you guys are having a wonderful day please don't forget to smash the like button hit the subscribe button if you're here for the first time people so let's get into the meat of the matter all right so first of all jamaica premier league is ranked number 10th in the Concacaf region um i think nicaragua Honduras, el salvador canada costa rica um usa i think liga mx is actually ranked number one MLS is second and these these leagues are actually ranked in front of Jamaica but we're ranked 10th which is quite I think that's fairly good but in the Caribbean region we're ranked number one in the Caribbean region which is also good which is definitely good as well so that's good to know that's some information okay so anyone anyone you think about this ranking just tell us what you think in the comment section go in the comment section and tell us what you think um so above you versus Umbe, Umbe Lion, don't be holding versus Mount Pleasant Let's get it cracking. So let's start off with Arbor View, um, Arbor View, um, Umber Lion first. So I know for a fact that Arbor View was played a lot of minutes. They just had to play against Portmore United, where the game went to extra time, penalty shootout. So you know that you're expected to see some tired legs. Possible, possible. Depends on Arbor View, um, rest and recuperation method that they implement, but they went to ex um. Penalty shootout with Portmore United in the links up link ups Friday and three days later they're gonna be going going head up. Now fortunately for them, they have already already have the aggregate in their in their in, in, in their advantage. A two nil going to this game with a two nil aggregate, which is quite good. So they have that pat already. So that's actually quite good for them. But I know for a fact that Umberland will be looking at this and say this is a perfect opportunity to just wear them down just a bit, keep the game as close as possible, wear them down just a bit and see if we can creep onto them in the last less 20 minutes of the game and see how, how best they can get something from it. I think that's that's a, that's, a, that's an approach that Umberland might take. Secondly, the second game of the day, um, Dumbo Holding versus Mount Pleasant. Last time my prediction was 1-0 <laughs> and um, it didn't really materialize went 1-0 until at 90 something minute and then no uh, Mount Pleasant equalized no surprising to me I really really find it surprising that Mount Pleasant that don't be holding push Mount Pleasant to that edge so far knowing that Mount Pleasant basically was resting all the time period and don't be holding had to play don't be holding had to play Lynx Cup in between so I was surprised that don't be looked the more fresher team the team who up for it the most I was really surprised about that Nevertheless, the game go on and, and, and football continues. No, so for me personally, I do expect to see a good matchup. I think all of you might still have it in them to still push through, even though we might see some tired legs. I think all of you might have it still have it in them to push through and get this through and get this and get, and get through to the, 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 the next round. I do believe so. I, I strongly believe so. They might have what it takes to push through and get to the next round. Now for the next matchup, don't be holding now. They just dropped out of the links cup. Um, last last Cavalier. Now this is the old thing that they have grasped into. Mount Pleasant. Now I was very much surprised of how how they underperform against Dumbo Holding the first leg. I was really really surprised about that. I do think that Dumbo Holding is the worst opponent to play against because you don't know which Dumbo Holding might turn up. The one that lost against Cavalier 3-0 or the one that drew with Mount Pleasant 1-1. One, one. I, I think I might go for this maybe going to extra time. Nilal and going to extra time. We might see probably penalties, maybe. But I don't think it's going to be much between both teams. Um, I If I should say fresh legs, I might go with Mount Pleasant. But I do think that Dumbo Holding have... I do think that Dumbo Holding have Mount Pleasant ticket. It seems that Dumbo have Mount Pleasant ticket. It just seemed that way. I'm going to go Dumbo again. I'm going to go Dumbo again to see how this one uh, materialize, materialize people. So anyways, smash the like button, hit the subscribe button. Is this a JPL quarterfinals um, matchup people? So smash the like button, hit the subscribe button. Tell us what you think in the comment section. Until next time people, MG Sports TV. A lot of movement. I'm out people. Boom.